all right what is up I'm super excited to show you guys what I'm about to show you right now it's actually something that I came across and someone actually recommended to me uh, not that long ago and what it is it's basically how to find any business in any niche that's currently spending advertising dollars so if you've already kind of done some sort of outreach when it comes to your social media marketing agency you've already found that there's some business owners that just can't afford your service right not every business can really afford to to pay like a fifteen hundred or two thousand dollar management fee so I've actually found a way to implement a strategy that will actually give me the contact information of businesses that are spending advertising dollars so these are I, the ideal clients that you want to work with for your social media marketing agency and the reason being is that these people already know the value of advertising and even more so if they're using some sort of online lead generation so even if they're using mailers they're more open to Facebook ads and someone who hasn't spent a single advertising dollar for their business and so I'm gonna lay it out all for you guys I highly suggest that as soon as you pick this up to start implementing it right away no one I guarantee you no one is really talking about this or knows about it if they do they're keeping it to themselves and you'll see exactly why it's highly effective if you have a niche that's not really known about then you're gonna be the first to be able to contact these people if you're like you know in a niche like gyms restaurants then it's still gonna give you the cream of the crop when it comes to your niche and it's gonna be very very effective so I say that you run with it start implementing it right away so let's get right into it so every library uh, you know I live here in in California so the library that I would go to is California I mean the Long Beach library whatever but every city has a library and if you have a library card what you can do is you can access go to for example I'll go to I'll go to mine right now go and type in your states library and then next to that put reference USA just like I put it down here and in my case it would be the LA County Library and so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on this it's gonna take me to a database guys every single library more than likely has reference USA as one of the databases that you're able to access all you need is a library card and you'll be able to access this information that I that I'm going to disclose for you guys right now so say you were in New York or you know say you were in San Diego Arizona whatever it might be go to your library if you have a library card then you can just simply log in and you'll be able to access all the databases one of them being reference USA if you don't have a library card uh, there's actually something you can do where you can virtually get a library card that's definitely super convenient so there's no excuse why you're not gonna be able to just absolutely dominate when it comes to prospecting so I'm gonna go to reference USA and what it's gonna do is it's gonna take me to this page here and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on US businesses search and so what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to just look for let's say I'm just gonna choose a niche here let's say roof roofers right I'm, I'm looking for roofers <coughs> and so automatically it's gonna give me the information to every roofing company in the entire United States like just hand like everything like Arkansas I mean this is this right here is just the first um, yeah, it's, it's in alphabetical order I believe so the first one is Arkansas here no no Alaska this is Alaska and it's gonna start by alphabetical order in Alaska so a and a roofing all this kind of stuff and so when you click on say for example let's go to a and a roofing it's gonna give us all the information <laughs> it, it's amazing you guys so it's gonna give us all the information to uh, that business if they do taxes then their information is on here and it's public record you guys it, I mean this stuff is lethal when it comes to 
uh, prospecting. So it's going to give you all their information, their phone, all that kind of stuff, their website, if they're posting on Indeed. I mean, imagine if this said like social media marketer or whatever it might be, you're going to be able to see that right here. And then here's the real cool part that I really wanted to show you guys. It's going to show the sales volume. It's going to show how many locations they have, how many employees they have, how many years they're in business, everything that you need to know about this business. Say, for example, that you need to know who's the CEO or the owner. You no longer have to look around or do any sort of that, like any sort of really in-depth digging, going to websites, searching in the about page. It's all here. Chuck, right here, for example, is the CEO of ANA Roofing. And here's the, here's the part that's really going to get you guys. It's really effective. Right here, we know that ANA Roofing is spending twenty to fifty thousand dollars on advertising. Now, this could be anywhere from you know posting ads on house.com, on any sort of thing that they've advertised. They're saying here, and, and it's, you know tax information, so they're not lying about it. It's twenty to fifty thousand dollars that they're spending, right, within that range. And guys, I mean, I'm, I'm telling you, this is a secret weapon. It's telling you how much their sales has gone, has progressed throughout the years. So obviously here, ANA Mortgage, I mean ANA Roofing Company, from 2016 to 2018, they've gone downwards. So they've kept the same employees. Obviously something has changed up, right? And so what you can do is you can just simply screenshot this if you really wanted to. And, and what you can do is you can show them all this information and you can show this to Chuck, for example. And the great thing about this is, is that you can actually export all this information. Everything that I've just shown you here, you can actually export. For those of you guys who are doing cold emails, you can actually export all of this. So let's say that I have all these roofing companies from Alaska, right? That's obviously, you're probably not going <laughs> to want to start off with Alaska but let's say we were doing Alaska right I live in Alaska and I'm looking for roofing companies that I want to generate leads for so I'm gonna go ahead and click all of these and it's giving, gonna give me a limit of 125 right on I don't think actually I do think I could do more than this yet I think it's about 250 that it lets me to do so I can practically just go crazy on this thing like let's see 200 and 25 and then 250 all right so that's the limit right there I don't think I can download more than 250 at a time kind of gives me a limit here so what I can do for these 250 that I collected is I can actually press download here and export this with the data that I want so press custom and in this right here, what I can do is I can actually put in that Excel sheet that I'll download or the CSV file, for example, certain key pieces of information. So let's see their websites. I'm actually doing this like live for you guys right here just so you can see exactly how to how to use this so you guys can implement it right away. And so let's see what else. There's a bunch of stuff. I mean, I know that you can, yeah, executive first name for each of the different, uh, obviously for a corporation, it'd be different executives and stuff. But here's the part where you can download is their advertising expenses. So all their advertising expenses, their LinkedIn, their Facebook. <coughs> That pretty much sums it up. I mean, there's other stuff in here that you'd probably want as well that might help you with reaching out. Obviously, the, the phone number and all that stuff you can include as well. Let's see if... Yeah, all of that stuff is, is there. Phone number combined. There it is. So all of the stuff, I'd basically press download records. And then I would basically get a CSV file or an Excel file of everything that I just showed you. So, I mean, this is powerful. Like, 
use this for any niche that you're currently in like say you were doing like restaurants gyms or you were doing you know even realtors or whatever it might be like even if you're more niche down to like maybe a kind of niche that no one knows about I mean, this is even better right so I would implement this right, ago, right away go to reference USA again it's a free it's basically free to the public as long as you have a library card and you can download all these different um, businesses that advertise already like you can literally filter it out so that you only have the information from businesses that already advertise and so once you have this information you can use it to cold email you can cold call them you can add them on LinkedIn you can add them on Facebook whatever your preference for, for actually outreaching uh, to these business owners is you can do that with this tool here so guys this is absolutely powerful I mean I've only seen one course that's ever even mentioned something like this so guys use this right away make 2019 great just absolutely dominate with the strategy if you have any questions whatsoever about you know the strategy or, or how to use you know some of the specific details then go ahead and drop a comment DM me on Instagram whatever it might be and I'll be glad to help so hope this was helpful and let me know uh, what are the things you guys want me to talk about.